Located on the border between Niagara Falls and Niagara on the Lake, Rugged Books restores 8 to 10,000 laptops and tablets for reuse each and every year. They partnered up with Crime Stoppers for a new initiative. We have Ahmed and Ziad here with us. Ahmed, let's begin with you. Tell me a little bit more about Rugged Books. How long have you been in Niagara? Yeah, so we are a family-owned business. We started in 2000, uh, 2016, and ever since then, we've grown year over year. We started with a small team. We've grown to 45 employees, and uh, we've been in Niagara Falls ever since we started. So we uh, started with computers, and then we eventually moved on to refurbishing rugged technology. The rugged part of your technology, I, I noticed on Facebook, you've got some laptops, some yeah. tablets, and they're really sort of fortified with an outer shell. Yeah. Why? Yeah, so rugged meaning they're very durable, right? So meaning you can drop them from anywhere and they won't you never break. Do that with your Essentially, laptop. they're used in the fields. They're used uh, outside in construction. There's different industries. Police is using them, uh, EMS and fire, because you need a durable computer that when you drop it, nothing will happen to it, right? Now, part of what your business is all about as well, besides that aspect, is about cybersecurity and helping people with that. And that's where this connection comes in with yeah. Crime Stoppers? Right. So we have a good team, uh, our, our director board leading Cal, who, is, uh, who has a background in engineering and technology, which includes cybersecurity. So we have a vast uh, resource when it comes to cybersecurity and knowing how we can improve internally for Rugged Books and as well as uh, educating people through Crime Stoppers as well. So Ziad, how did this connection come about? So I've known uh, Mr. Naz Nahla and uh, Kefal, the family who started Rugged Books for many, many years. And I know the heart of generosity to help improve the Niagara community. And they want to use their business, <clears throat> they want to use their business to, you know, uh, help others. So when it came to um, uh, Khaled Kefal, you know, the uh, his expertise and his background with working with the uh, BlackBerry and now with the Microsoft uh, cyber teams. So it's very valuable. And uh, Crime Stopper already does um, scam alerts on the latest scams and uh, different things, but we're not experts. So that's where uh, Rugged Books and their team brings that expertise to help us educate um, and, uh, you know, um, uh, to have our community be aware of the latest scams. I get a lot of these phishing attempts. They're, they're now going through not just email, yeah. telephone calls, but now texts, all of these things. Seniors especially are vulnerable. Yes, seniors, because, you know, um, Crime Stopper already does the, um, for a number of years, we've done the Elders Abuse Awareness Program. So in that program, we try to have the elders be aware of the um, uh, different scams and stuff that they have and you know unfortunately cyber attacks are on the rise and it's tend to be very lucrative for uh, the criminals uh, involved and again like Niagara has a very high and large population of our seniors so they will get uh, you know we get a lot of answers uh, questions about uh, the cyber attacks and how to protect ourselves so Crime Stoppers we do our best to help aware uh, the you know our community especially our seniors but we're not experts now with our partnership with the rugged books we have to we hope to have different workshops and to educate um, our community like mostly seniors and how to uh, you know be prepared and um, protect themselves from uh, cyber attacks um, these cyber attacks have been become much much more sophisticated right. and harder to block yeah. I, I, I can spend all day blocking calls mm -hmm. blocking texts, but they show up again what can rugged books do to help people Get beyond that yeah so our number one goal is for education first once you're aware uh, of the attacks and the threats then you can start implementing different practices right so there are different uh, softwares you can use especially on the computer uh, you can there's different resources when it comes to blocking uh, um, uh, phone calls or email messages obviously you have to be aware of this so you can uh, understand it and then you can use certain practices which will uh, you know, so you, you can deflect any uh, attacks that may happen. Ziad, why are seniors more susceptible to this? Because it's just like they're the most vulnerable and Niagara has a very high senior population, you know. So for example, you know, you will get when a senior, they're an easy target, you know, because they're vulnerable and, you know, for them, to, for example, them getting a call, you know, sometimes they're not out and about uh, to be um, educated. Sometimes uh, they live, you know, um, uh, separately so they're not aware of that uh, for example you know 
the main thing is like you know to educate them on changing your password not sharing any uh, information if you haven't bought a lottery ticket and you know someone calls you about a lottery ticket you get an email those are obvious signs you know so they tend to sometimes you know forget about things you know you get a uh, an email that you received the package or you know you get an email that you need to change your uh, certain bank uh, password well you don't have an account on that you know to educate them on not clicking on a certain things because you know it can be um, you know, very um, uh, one click away from being a victim, you right. know, or, or these calls that you constantly get, you know, just like we talked about this briefly, you know, like yesterday I got three of them. And it's just like, you know, the criminals are always a step or two ahead of us. So we tend to like always react. But with having rugged books and their expertise and Mr. Kafel's uh, expertise with cybersecurity, with the workshops we're trying to prepare to educate uh, our community and mainly seniors, I think it will be very helpful and it will be very informative to give them the tools uh, to uh, be aware and take care. When do you see those workshops? Um, in the very near future. So our partnership is very new. So they are, they are very willing and they've been very helpful uh, right away. So we have um, tend to do uh, workshops with different uh, senior centers and stuff like that. So the next one that we're going to have come in, we will have uh, posted on our website and our Facebook. And you can follow us on there. And uh, we're already, uh, there are some things on uh, works. So the questions that we get from seniors and stuff like that to uh, help and some of the crimes that we're aware of to uh, you know, make it very informative and very simple for them to understand. And Rugged Book has done an amazing job already, and they're just like willing to do more and more. And it's absolutely um, a perfect and a priceless partnership with us. Ziad, Ahmed, thanks for joining us today. Thank you, Mike. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks.